Hello everybody and welcome to GameStream. Vitrix here today bringing you Five Nights at Freddy's 3. Yeah, this game got released uh, as of recording uh, two days ago, I believe. So I bought it, was going to record it earlier, but I had a massive power cut, so I couldn't. Haven't seen anything on it already. I hate him hating this. So, without further ado, new game. Fazbear's Fright, the horror attraction. Local amusement parks get ready to scale socks off a new attraction based on the unsolved mysteries of Freddy Fazbear Pizza. Featuring actual relics from the decades old pizzeria, this attraction is guaranteed to bring your childhood in the worst possible way. Nah, thank you. I'm good there. Ooh. Oh my god, what? Oh, ooh. Hey, hey, glad you came back for another night. I promise it'll be a lot more interesting this time. Another night? Some, some great new relics over the weekend, and we're out tracking down a new lead right now. So, uh, let me just update you real quick, then you can get to work. Like, the attraction opens in like a week, so we have to make sure everything works and nothing catches on fire. Uh, when the place opens, people will come in at the opposite end of the building and work their way toward you and past you Hi. and out the exit. Uh, yeah, you've officially become part of the attraction. Uh, you'll be starring as the security guard. So not only will you be monitoring the people on the camera as they pass through, you know, to make sure no one steals anything or makes out in the corner, but you'll also be a part of the show. It'll make it feel really authentic, I think. Uh, now let me tell you about what's new. We found another set of drawings, always nice, and a boxy head, which we think could be authentic. Then again, it might just be another crappy cosplay. And we found a desk fan, very old school, metal though. So watch the fingers. Uh, <laughs> uh, right now the place is basically just, you know, flashing lights and spooky props. But I honestly thought we'd have more by now. Uh, if we don't have something really cool by next week, so we may have to suit you up in a furry suit and make you walk around saying, Boo! <laughs> uh, but, you know, like I said, we're trying to track down a good lead right now. Uh, some guy who helped design one of the buildings says it was like an extra room that got boarded up or uh, something like that. So we're going to take a peek and see what we can find. Uh, for now, just get comfortable with the new setup. Um, you can check the security cameras over to your right with the click of that blue button. Uh, you can toggle between the hall cams and the vent cams. Uh, then over to your far left, uh, you can flip up your maintenance panel. You know, use this to reboot any systems that may go offline. <laughs> so in trying to make the place feel vintage, we may have overdone it a bit. <laughs> Some of this equipment is barely functional. Yeah, I wasn't joking about the fire. That's, that's, that's a real risk. Uh, the most important thing you want to watch for is the ventilation. Look, this place will give you the spooks, man. And if you let that ventilation go off wide, then you'll start seeing some crazy stuff, man. Keep that air flowing. Okay, keep an eye on things, and we'll try to have something new for you tomorrow night. What? The fuck is this? Okay, so I know the main ethos of this game is it's set 30 years after the events of the first game. And they're trying to make a horror attraction. And it seems that we are playing the role of the security guard and we're trying to make it as authentic as humanly fucking possible. I just don't like that guy. Um. Oh, it's just to restart some things. So it seems we can just... Replay part. Replay like sounds to creep things out. I mean, I'm not greatly sure what I'm looking for. Because it's 5 a.m. I did the first night! <laughs> oh my god, they're another- they're doing mini games again? Oh, I'm Freddy. Follow me. It's Purple Freddy. It's the purple man again. He was on the second game. 
Okay, so Freddy's following Purple Freddy. It's stormy night. Sounds a strangely realistic error. Error. Why is that an error? Oh, why? Is that Purple Man again? He was in the second game. I mean, no, I know first night's meant to be easy, but seriously, what? Alright. Hey man, okay, I have some awesome news for you. First of all, we found some vintage audio training cassettes. Dude, these are like prehistoric. I think they were like training tapes for like other employees or something like that. So, I thought we could like have them playing like over the speakers as people walk through the attraction. Dude, that makes this feel legit, man. But I have an even better surprise for you. And you're not gonna believe this. We found one. A real one. Uh, 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 uh gotta go, man. Uh, well, well look, it, it's in there somewhere. I, I'm sure you'll see it. Okay, I'll leave you with some of this great audio that I found. Talk to you later, man. Uh, hello? Hello, hello? Uh, welcome to your new career as a performer slash entertainer for Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. No. Uh, this tape will provide you with much needed information on how to handle slash climb into slash climb out of mascot costumes. What? Right now we have two specially designed suits that double as both animatronic and suit. So it's please pay error. close attention while learning how to operate these suits as accidents slash injuries slash death slash irreparable and protest oh. maiming can occur. First, what the fuck? How to operate the mascots when they are in animatronic form. For ease of operation, what is that? Fuck! Fuck! No! No, what the fuck was that? What was that? I don't. Why am I like blacking out? Why is he. Why is that? Hey! Hey, buddy! You just stay there! Don't come any closer! Okay? Go away! <laughs> Fuck off! I don't want you here! Get away! It's 3 a.m. Fucking lost three more hours just sitting here. This is so fucking confusing. Okay, so what I can gather from this so far, I'm going to talk to you guys, is that there's one animatronic after you instead of like seven or however many more in the fucking second game. Um, they can crawl in vents in which you can seal, which is quite fun. You don't have any doors again, don't have any Freddy hat. I think playing the audio through the camera, the speaker, the cameras might like. Get them away from your door. Um, but I think you have to seal the vents that they're in to stop them from getting near you. And then when they're out of the vents, open them because you need air. And I think some breakdowns so need to reboot them. I didn't get a word of what the hell the guy said that last one. He just appeared out of fucking nowhere. Fuck. That's oh, so actually, I suppose that was an audio tape. Anyway. Let's do it again. We can't stop there. Fuck, oh, this is going to be a tough one. This is going to be tough. Right, let's get straight in this. We don't have any power or uh, flashlight. We don't have any flashlights. We don't have any... Um, we don't have anything like that, which is good, because we can't. means we can't run out of anything. Which is good. I mean, I don't know of a company that doesn't have enough money to fucking not, like, run power through the night. Nothing's working, but barely anything's working. There's a lot more cameras, there's no animatronic yet. Cam 8. Hi. Where 
Die gone. Uh oh. Okay. He goes where you play the audio. Ha 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 He's in a van. What is that noise? What is that noise? Hello. He's right out there. I saw that. I, s I saw that. And I didn't like it. I'm going to take this moment to apologise for not talking much. This game's scary and I need to concentrate. So I will try and talk to the best of my ability. But what I found out with some of these. Um, if you look a different way or you look in a camera, they'll get you. It's 3am. I'm going to wait. Hey, I'm going to wait. You're just going to fucking sit there, aren't you? You're not going to move. You're not going to come get me unless I look up in a camera. Well, that's not happening. I'm not touching anything. It's 3am. Something's failing. I have to reboot something. Yep, and I blacked out. Oh, I was almost expecting that. What the hell do I do? We can do this, guys. We can do this. First, find the location of Le Animate Foo, Nick. Where are you, buddy? Yeah, bitch! Try and get through the vent now, huh? Then get through no vents. Nah, mate, you ugly prick. Look at you. So you crawl back into this fucking room here. You dick. Go on. Good boy. Oh, fuck me, that was creepy. I did not like that. I knew that was gonna happen when I saw its face. I didn't jump. I still shat. He's gonna be right out, right by my door, isn't he? What the fuck? Go away. I saw you. I saw you, and I don't like you. Alright. Screw the fuck off. You kindly would. This is bad enough as it is. Oh, it's 5am. I can make that. No. Fuck you, mate. You're not getting me. No. <sighs> I don't like this. I'm getting chills all over my body. Taking over any time now would be nice, thank you. Before the ventilation fails and I'm instantly killed. No, come on! Yes! <laughs> See, if I was this guy, I'd complain. I'd say, there's things trying to kill me, I quit.